welcome back to our channel if you'd like to know how I made this delicious chapman in just two minutes then keep watching today I'll show you how to make a mocktail called chapman well that's what it's called in Nigeria I don't know what the real name is but it is basically a very simple mocktail that everybody will enjoy and it's so easy to make the main three ingredients are these so you're using the Nigerian Fanta which is very orange it's different from the Fanta you find in the UK so if you want this Fanta you have to go to an African store or a Nigerian store near you I feel like the normal orange uh, yellow Fanta will be fine but I've never used that for this mocktail before you will need Ribena and then you need Sprite okay so let's get right into it I'll show you the secret ingredients in a minute but basically you need equal parts of Fanta and Sprite okay so I've got 500 milliliter um, or 50 cl of Fanta and Sprite I'm just gonna pour it into my jar pour them at the same time or you can pour them separately it doesn't matter I'm just gonna save myself some time by pouring them both in that's my Fanta and Sprite mixture now I'll add my Ribena because Ribena is usually very concentrated I will just put half the quantity of my Fanta so if for example if your Fanta is 50 cl then you want to put 25 cl of Ribena okay or if you're using 100 cl of Sprite and Fanta each then you need 50 cl of Ribena but if your Ribena is diluted then you can put the same amount as the Sprite and Fanta so that might that's I'm just gonna guesstimate so that's 25 CL 250 milliliters of Ribena has gone in there this is already it's a lovely mocktail that a child will enjoy and an adult will enjoy but this is the secret ingredient it's called Angostura Bitter it gives this mocktail a very unique taste this adds that extra genesakoa and makes this the proper chapman if not it will just be a sweet mocktail so it adds a little bit of bitter to it so if you can get your hands on this get it it's quite expensive but it lasts over a year or two years depending on how frequently you do chapman so you just need about two to three dashes because it's quite bitter so one two three so that's about one teaspoon of angostura bitter that's your chapman done very easy you don't need to spend thousands on this when you can do it at home it's super easy all i need to do now is put it in my glass jar or my cup and enjoy it and i'll show you how i garnish it so yeah to make it look all fancy all you need is a slice of lemon orange i even use kiwi you can use any fruit you like or strawberry and then you put your ice cube in you can chop the ice cube into the pitcher if you like or you can put it in in your glass directly then you pour it in so yeah that, there you have it that's your chapman in less than two minutes it's just so delicious <laughs> you can make this into a cocktail if you like so instead of using sprite you can use prosecco or you can just add a touch of vodka or tequila to make this even <laughs> turn from a mocktail to a cocktail yeah so try it out and let me know how you get on this was my favorite drink growing up i had it for special occasions when we went out we had this but now i can do it at home i do it i can do it for my family you can do it as well because it's so easy and you save a lot of money because instead of paying five times the price when you go out to a restaurant you can double or triple the recipe to do it for a special occasion like a birthday party or a get together let me know how you get on till next time keep living loving and laughing bye <laughs> Be nice. Oh, that's really nice. That's good, yeah? Cheers. 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 <laughs> so, so, into, <laughs> into, okay. <laughs> Go, ahead. Go ahead. 